Hey guys, so if you're anything like Megan and I, you feel like you need every single tool on That's the true. market. It's a real struggle, right? It is a real struggle. <laughs> well, Zutter now has the Tool It All by Ken Oliver, which is nine tools in one. So, oh, nine tools. Yeah, so there's lots you can do with this. It's titanium steel, so really durable, and it has lots of different ends. So you're well, gonna show us one. Yeah, and especially if you are someone that loves to use intricate dyes, this brush tip here is going to save the day. So I went ahead and already cut out my die here. And we've all been there, you peel away your die cut and you're stuck with all of the yucky little papers mm -hmm. in the die. And it takes so much time to poke each individual paper out. Not with the brush. You take the brush and you honestly just go over the holes and it pops Pop out, right out all of those papers. I mean, you can see here, it's just popping all of those out. And if for some reason you can't get to the smaller guys here with the brush, you use the poker tool here and you just poke out any remaining little papers that got stuck. Perfect, yeah. and it's all connected. That's right, super easy. There's more pieces that connect to this too. So she just showed you the pointy tip. There's yep. also a flat tip yep. poker, and then you get a little spatula, and then three embossing tips, small, medium, and large, which is great for yep. burnishing. So And that little spatula tip, I know people, um, they use that a lot of times with their silhouette or their cameo to get up the adhesive vinyl, so. Yeah, exactly, and then, I, just, I know I'm showing you this in the little like foam thing here, but we don't even need this because you'll probably no. face it, you'll lose this. You'll lose that, right. They come right out and they actually store right in the tool. In the tool. So, so you don't right lose them. There. And you won't, yeah, you will never have to go searching for no. the pieces that go to your tool. And especially with smaller pieces like that, it's easy for them to go missing, not with this. And then you just take your end here and you screw it right back on. And I know Katie mentioned the other tips that you can use. This also comes with three um, craft knives. So you can just pull those out and then to add the knives, you just unscrew this end here. The tip will slide out. You grab one of your craft knives, it slides right in there. And then you just tighten it up away. and you're ready to go. Super Perfect. easy, yeah. And then the brush part actually comes right oh, yeah. off too and there's a brayer that you can mm -hmm. replace it with. So you just screw the brayer on. The brayer, and I know um, people use these brayers a lot of times like in mixed media for paints mm -hmm. and inks. However, I've also seen it used with um, the Stick It and intricate dies as well. So I'm just gonna show you here. I have my little die cut here with my Stick It. I'm gonna peel it off. And then stick it's adhesive for those mm -hmm. of you that yep. are familiar. That really nice adhesive for your dyes. And if I, you know, if I want to stick it there, but then I decide, you know, I don't want it there. I actually, whoops, I want it over here. I can move it, and then I can take my brayer and actually press it down, nicely adhering it to awesome. my project. Awesome. No so. fingerprints. On no, there. You perfect. Just use the brayer tool. Mm -hmm. Awesome. So that is. Nine tools Nine in tools. one. It's the Zutter Tool It All by Ken Oliver. Guys, definitely check it out and you won't have all those problems of needing every tool because you'll have it all in one.